Guys, today we're going to be showing how to make cheesy garlic breadsticks. The ingredients for the garlic butter are chopped garlic, coriander, chili flakes, some oregano seasoning, and salted butter. And for the garlic breadsticks, we will need two slices of bread, one cheese cube, and one cheese slice. So, let's get started. Now, we're going to start by preparing the garlic butter. First, take some garlic, put them in a bowl. Next, take some coriander leaves and put them in the same bowl. Next, take a pinch of chili flakes, depending on your spice level. Just sprinkle a bit on the coriander. Next, take a pinch of oregano seasoning and then sprinkle some. Now, here I'm using salted butter. Take some salted butter. Use some, put it in, put it in your garlic and coriander seasoning. Okay. Now we're going to have to mix all of this together to make the garlic butter. We'll see you after some time. So as you can see, I've finished mixing the garlic butter. So now it's ready to use. So here I have my two bread slices and my cheese. So I'm going to take some garlic butter. And I'm going to just spread it evenly on the slice of bread. Okay, so now that I've spread the uh, garlic butter on the bread, I'm going to grate. Okay guys, so now that we have spread the garlic butter on both the slices, we're going to start to grate the cheese. So guys, now I've grated the cheese and I have some extra slices of cheese in small pieces to make it more cheesy. So now I'm going to take some grated cheese and I'm going to sprinkle it all over the bread slice. Make sure it's all in the middle. Now I'm going to place some cheese slices to give it more of a cheesy texture. So now I'm going to put the other slice of bread on top of this. Just press it, press it nicely so that all the cheese is in there. Now I'm going to take some more garlic butter. And I'm going to spread it on this, on the top part. So you shouldn't spread it on the bottom side yet. But you will be doing that pretty soon. So... Now that I've spread it on, I've finished spreading it on the top side, I'm, we're going to now place it on a preheated pan. So, and I also have some, I have, I have another idea. We could use, my idea is that we could use this in a pan, or you could use it in a sandwich maker. So... <laughs> Next, since we finished this, we're going to put it on a preheated pan. Okay, so <laughs> it's right here and we have a preheated pan right here. So now I'm going to put the bread slices on the pan. Make sure your butter side is facing <laughs> down. Okay, so it's getting cooked. And I'm going to apply some more garlic butter while it's getting cooked. So, it's going to be nice and garlicky. Yeah, that's good enough. 
So now we're going to make sure it's nicely cooked. Now flip the bread. Now you can flip the bread. You see it's nice and golden brown. It looks really nice. So now we have to just leave the other side to get cooked. And we'll see you after a minute. So now we've flipped our bread. It's nicely cooked. And the cheese is melted. So now let's try this out. Let's see how it is. Okay, now let's cut the garlic breadsticks. Whoa, it's so cheesy and it looks so yummy. See how the cheese is melted from the outside? It looks so yummy. Thank you for watching and do try this at home. Bye. Bye.